The Princess and the Frozen Peas There was once a young, beautiful princess who lived in a huge kingdom. One day, a very cranky old king came to the royal palace, intending to marry the princess. Oh no, thought the princess. I can't marry him. The king wants proof that she's a real princess before he marries her, said one servant. A real princess won't be able to sleep if there is even only one tiny pea underneath a big pile of mattresses, said the other. I am a real princess, thought the princess, but I will pretend that I'm not. The servants crept into her room and placed a single pea under her pile of mattresses. <sighs> oh, I'm so sleepy, yawned the princess, and pretended to sleep. The servants watched the princess. Look, she's already asleep. The king will be so angry, cried one. Maybe one pea wasn't enough, said the other servant. We must prove that she is a princess. The next night, they crept into her room. Lots of frozen peas should do the trick, they whispered. Oh, oh, I am so terribly tired, said the princess. She began snoring loudly. The next morning she rose with the sun. What a wonderful night's sleep I have had! The princess smiled. The servants looked worried. But I really haven't slept a wink, thought the princess secretly. The servants told the king what had happened. Let's try other things that start with the letter P said one servant. Good idea, said the other servant. That's almost as good as a real pea. The servants put some prickly porcupines into her bed, but still the princess slept. Ouch! They tried a pirate. Arr! And a panda. Oof. A peacock. Oh, my feathers. And a painter. Voila. But still, the princess slept. Soon, it was the morning of the wedding. She is not a princess, said the servants to the king. Ugh. Ugh. Call off the wedding, sighed the king, and he left. Phew, said the princess. She didn't have to marry the old king. And now, she said, I can finally get a good night's sleep. <laughs>